Sure. Uh, long story short, uh, I have a master's degree in statistics and econometrics. I started my career in banking sector in the uh, French bank legal, Crédit Agricole, uh, where I started as a data scientist. Then I was leading the data science team. And then before uh, leaving there, I was uh, the head of data analytics and digital marketing. I spent a couple of months at uh, PricewaterhouseCoopers in uh, Luxembourg and uh, from June I joined uh, Deloitte and I'm working as an AI data science manager in the AI and data department. Yeah, uh, so, the, so the topic will be a uh, latest year use case in AI, but I will have an emphasis on uh, why the banking sector is behind other sectors uh, like retail and uh, in terms of use of machine learning, so what are the key uh, points, what's making banking struggling with uh, embracing uh, the full potential of AI and machine learning. And uh, some of these key use cases are can really bring um, uh, machine learning and AI to, uh, in banking into full play. We will have uh, some um, use cases that can work uh, depending on the area and the, or the regulation because most of the things that why AI is not working, uh, is banks are not embracing AI because of regulatory aspects and so uh, some of these use cases have can show the banks a way to deal with it and some of them will be more focused, customer focus oriented, some of them will be more process oriented so it will be a part of latest use cases of AI. Well, for me, it's all about uh, data management and data governance because these are the pillar of having a good uh, data science and data, I mean, data science from, and the AI from overall um, uh, use cases and, and uh, having this. So it's all starts about uh, data governance and uh, data management, having this foundation, having clean data, uh, comprehensive data, documented data, having business glossaries, understanding the meaning. Because what is tricky in banking, uh, we hire data scientists, but these data scientists are not really, at the beginning, they will take like three or four years, maybe sometimes two years for the very quick one uh, to understand the business because it's not like manufacturing on other business. It's quite a tricky. We have a lot of financial aspect, trading aspects, and uh, compliance, a lot of things. And so for data scientists, it's very hard, hard to digest all of these aspects. So having clean data, well-documented data, it's accelerate these things. So data scientists can really understand the, the, the business and be in the operational and in like a, maybe a couple of months. And that's, that's why I think a data management, data governance is the key in banking for embracing this uh, AI. Okay, so for the moment, uh, like, like what I've seen in banking is um, people think AI and machine learning is too complex. So to deal with that problem was like showing executive and people who take the decision that ML is not machine learning or AI is not sophisticated things. It can bring value very quickly with a real concrete example. Uh, we can take every like fraud, for instance, so we can like take all the, 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 the pain points in fraud and the, the amount of money each, the bank lose every year. And using an AI model, you can have a simulation and show them, okay, if you use that model, and based on this assumption, we will at least save you this amount of money. So with concrete examples, showing them the timeline for installing the mo this model and also what will be the added value of the model, that gives them insurance and they, they wanted to do it. Like I've seen a lot of executives and are pushing throughout AI. And but as I said before, the main problem they have, they, they don't trust the quality of the data they have and there is no real data governance because we don't know who owns the data, we don't know who uh, has uh, who can give us the sense the meaning of each data so this is the main problem for banks but some banks overcome this problem and now they are pushing ai in every aspect of the bank well i am really looking to see uh, the community and share with them and learn from them so Looking forward to see you guys and uh, I hope you are not going to miss this webinar because uh, there will be like outstanding topics, uh, real good uh, 
AI application. And so I think it's very good opportunity to share and to learn from uh, people from around the industry, across the industry.